Hi guys, welcome, 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 welcome. We're gonna do Libra. <clears throat> okay, we are going to do Venus and Libra. And it's gonna go now until the 20th. I feel like I just did Taurus and I feel like whatever was happening, and I don't know if it's just with Taurus, but Taurus is, you know, in Venus. So I feel like by Memorial Day weekend is what I was saying. So it's like, or you might be with that person by Memorial Day weekend, but that was like Taurus, that Taurus energy. But again, we're all in Taurus energy, you know? So it's like, it's, it's that type of thing. So, but right now my focus is on Libra and Venus. Okay, my little librarians. Okay, my little librarians. <clears throat> Libra. And welcome, welcome, welcome. Messenger of Earth. <clears throat> I'm just gonna pull the cards. Like I did with Taurus. Get the tower. Libra, Libra. So it's like you're going to get in the Two of Fire. So it's like Six of Earth at the bottom of the deck. Messenger of Earth. The tower. Two of Fire. So it's like there is need there is need for synergy right here okay um this tower is going to get you on your path you're going to get a message and it's either gonna it's, it's gonna make you get going okay that is for sure i i don't know i, I feel like a sandstorm i i mean it's a draft it's not a camel but like the draft is moving slow all right but it, it's it's moving so this tower is going to cause you to to, to soul search, to go in a new direction with or without, okay? Venus in the Libra, please. And it's like, you're going to get a message that's, it, it looks like it's going to be sudden. It's going to be shocking. It's it's, it's going to be a, quite a message, okay? We got finances in Korea for the message. So it's like, you're going to get a message, all right? Um, this tower is not good. It's about deception, But it's still good. It's, well, listen, it's still a good tower, but there's deception. So the deception is either from the past, and then you got soulmate and new love. Okay. It's tricky. You got romantic feelings for somebody for sure. Clear as day. Um, you're going to get a message. Either you're at work or something went down at work. This tower is like, it's going to hurt. But it's, it's good because it's going to bring you, it's going to make you soul search, okay? And it's like, there is someone in your life right now. Yes, they are a soulmate. You don't need to question it, you know? Um, because it, I feel like it, it's something new. Someone new came into your life or someone new is about to come into your life. So I feel like, <clears throat> I feel like it's like you're leaving something, whether you wanted to or not, to endure something new. And I feel like some of you are like, is this the right time? Should I do this? It, it's so new. You know, this, a lot of people, okay, I mean, my cards are very differently for the newbies. <clears throat> this has always been deception for me, always. This is not, hey, we're getting married. <clears throat> Never, ever in the book of forever. This is deception. <clears throat> and, you know, there's, there's something going on here with, with finances, too. So, you could be working and you get a message, or there's... <clears throat> there's exterior energy like oh somebody hooked up with somebody or, or, or somebody somebody's doing this somebody's doing that it, it's like it's shady it's shady and it's like but something comes out you know I, I think it's something you've been wanting to hear somebody had an affair at work it is something this tower is a good thing because it pu it's putting you on a new path and it's like, I don't know if right now you're like, oh, you don't really know, but you know, but you don't have all the answers. Well, you're about to get a message. And this person might be linked to your finances. You, you, It's a possibility. You could have been in a marriage and you met someone new and you wanted out, you know, and, and you're finally, you're finally doing it. Because now the universe has to interfere. Because it's like not wanting to see something or not wanting to, to move forward. You know what I mean? So it's like now... Now it's like, it's just 
universal interference. Tell me about this finances and career. Um, <clears throat> but somebody met somebody new. And if you haven't, you will. The magician. <clears throat> One more. Tell me about the magician. <clears throat> Temperance. Somebody's trying to balance something out. Someone's trying trying to create something new, but it has to do with, with money. So I don't know if somebody met somebody at work and there was something tricky that happens. You know what I mean? Like, we got the devil at the bottom of the deck. Tell me about the magician. So this is, you know, it's, it's almost like if you've been trying and you know that you shouldn't be, it's one of those scenarios, you know, it's like, it's, it's no good. You got the page of wands and it's, it's reversed. So it's like, yeah, see this magician, it's like... It's just energy of like you were in a no good scenario. It's like somebody doesn't want that new start. I think because they got a new start with someone, someone else. It's like you, somebody was in a relationship or a situation ship for way too long, whether it was work or love, okay? Because it's Venus, work and love. And it's like the t the universe came in and was like, nah, you're, you're not seeing something. It, you, and you want you want what you want but like it's probably not that person or a workplace and it's like we're putting you on a new path and when you do you're gonna find this but I feel like you met somebody new tell me about the tower because this this tower is is one of those moments where it's like it's finally like a wake up like yeah I get it you know it's it's the king of swords so it is it's coming from it's this is they talk okay and that's no bullshit and I think they're going to tell you they don't want to put the time and effort into anything anymore because at the bottom of the deck is the page of coin. But it's like somebody's still kind of holding on to something. All right. So it's like, I think you're about to find out. This could even be a Sag. But I, I don't like to look at it like that ever, not temperance. But it's like somebody's trying to balance. It's a two of cups. Somebody's trying to balance relationships. It's, or, you know what I mean? Or somebody met somebody at work or something. An authority figure is something. Okay. Um, so this has to do with the King of Swords, a uh, uh, masculine energy in your life if you're feminine or vice versa. Tell me about deception. And this deception is something tricky. It, it could have been, if you're together, it could have to do with your finances or there was, that's too many, there was some type of an affair happening in the universe. It's like, this is, this is enough, enough's enough. I made the fool of reverse. Yeah, see, it's, it's, it's tricky energy. It's not wanting that new start. Maybe you thought you were going to have wedding plans, but it's like, nah, it's like you got tricked. The, to me, this person made a foolish move. You know, but it's it's the... Regardless, I think somebody was in a situation for way too long anyway. There, There's new here, whether that is linked to you or this other person. But to me, it's, it's my Libras that are about to have a new start and meet somebody new. Tell me about this a fire so it's like let's go you have no choice but to soul search okay and it's like the two of swords making a decision with the strength card gotta go okay and when you do i think this is when this is gonna come in a new person stirred your romantic feelings or or it's this other person and it's like it's it's like hang up we're hung up okay because it's like do i want that back or not because it's like you really don't want to let go of it because when the tower comes in it's, it's forced. It's it's divine intervention. And it's like, you don't want to make a decision. It's like someone here doesn't want to move forward, but it's like, have the strength and, and, and still go in this direction. You have to. It's like, this one doesn't have a blindfold. It's like, you know, you got news or there is something. It's like, you, you gotta you gotta keep going. Okay, it's the only way to, to gain balance in your life. And, and you guys are all about balance. What's right, what's wrong. You got caught up in karma. Tell me about soulmate. This new love might be a Pisces too, but it, it's on it's on hold because for some of you it's on hold because you keep going back to the same person that you should not be with because this person is definitely with somebody else or vice versa. Okay, and it's like soulmate. I definitely feel like you you're gonna get a message. Queen of Coin reverse. All right, so it's like you're no longer gonna put effort into something. But you're still deciding, do I or do I not? This this person lied to me. They cheated. Or, or X, Y, Z, do I give them a second chance? But it's like, it looks like at the end of the day, you're not going to put effort into it. Tell me about this message. That's 
way too many. But that was judgment. Somebody wants forgiveness, or that's what you're seeking. It's the only one I saw. All right, so you, you got to push through. It's, it's like you're being forced to, to soul search. Yeah, see, five of pence. It's the cups reverse. There's, there's not enough love here with somebody. It, it was you not having enough self-love for yourself to get yourself out of this situation. So it's like, it's it's not good. I mean, and you're considering going back to something that's not good or staying in something that you stayed in that's no good. And it's like, come on. And I don't know, Venus and Libra, I don't know if it's like you're, you're around, sticking around because you guys are linked to money. But it's like, they're going to take away that money from you real quick. And they're going to be like, oh, yeah? You're only staying for money? All right, I'm going to take away the money. Then what? You know, it's like, that's what's going to... This is it's tough. This is tough. You need to, to move forward. And I think you're deciding whether or not, you know... Um, that's, again, way too many. I think you're deciding whether or not to... You know you should move forward. You know. You know. <clears throat> well, whatever this is. Self-esteem. Yeah, so it, it's just, it's, it's the karma. You feel like a failure. It, it's, it's like, it's like learn though, okay? It's like, <clears throat> it's like you need more confidence in this situation to move forward. It, we still have you know, <clears throat> a little insecurities. You must have been with somebody for a long time. But it's like, don't, you didn't fail, okay? It's an opportunity to learn whether this is you or the other person. Okay, but to me, this is Libra's lesson. You know, somebody made a mistake for sure. That's why that judgment was there. But it's like, learn from that mistake. Don't repeat that mistake. Learn from it. Do some mirror magic. Do some affirmations. Tell yourself you're beautiful. Okay, because right now we got, you know, lack of self-love. Whether it's you or this other person. And, and then it's like seven of swords. You know, and it's like, again, it's some type of something. But it's like eight of cups. You know, so it's like, but it's reversed. So it's like, are you going to walk back to this person? And underneath that's the emperor reversed. And the emperor reversed is <clears throat> somebody who's very impatient and... <clears throat> wants things their way so you got decisions to make because this doesn't look like a shift that something's going to change in a good direction you know I feel like what you deserve is out there but you have to s stop nurturing something that's not moving forward what's next <clears throat> Libra and Venus <clears throat> Venus and Libra what's next for Venus and Libra what's next what's next <clears throat> it looks like there's beauty in the future or kind of even as you start your path, sometimes they bring people into other people's lives to, to realize, you know, like, hey, just hey, you know, because I do feel energy of, of a breakup and then somebody new, whether it's on your side or theirs, but if they left because there was somebody new or infidelity or whatever the case may be, like, I still feel like for my Libra, it's like as soon as you get yourself out of this situation, here comes this new that you thought didn't exist or it's going to be mind-blowing. All right, so right now, what's next for you? Spend some time in meditation, all right? Spiritual learning, teaching, self-discovery, finding out who you are. And that's a big message for who is this relates to because there's no self-love here. The self-esteem is, is, is so low. You're in the lesson right now to, to stop telling yourself you're no good. Stop telling yourself you failed. Stop telling yourself it was your fault. You know, it's like you could have even been, I meant to mention this earlier and I didn't, but you could have even been with a partner that's like, you're not going to meet anybody that's better than me. Because it's like, you know, it's like it's that type of energy. And, and once, you know... And then at the bottom of the deck, so it's like once you self-discover who you are, there's your nine of water, which is coming true. Old old concerns and karma fades away. It's a love life, a new love life. Okay? So please take care of you. Please. I love you guys. Have a great day.